All right, I got a slew of students here from Tribeca Flashpoint. Quickly, everybody, tell me who you are. Samson Doble. Luke Cody. Matthew Haynes. Sean McNamara. All right, Sean, we'll start with you. What is uh, What are you learning at Tribeca? Uh, we're running a lot of cooperative uh, environmental work. We're working in, in large groups, small groups, very iterative processes, you know, so we're constantly re regrowing and remaking games and we're redoing the process over and over. We're going from start of production cycle to end of production cycle. We're doing post-mortems, you know, we have leads, we have lower people, so we're learning the whole chain of command as well as the full production cycle. It's very exciting. So is Sean difficult to work with? Oh yeah, totally, <laughs> totally. No, no, he's a great designer. I really enjoy working with him right now. So hold it. So what, what's been the most difficult thing about uh, well game developing, and what is specifically are you doing? Uh, well, I'm a producer on a, on a couple products now. Um, I'd say uh, just the most difficult thing is just uh, you know starting with a new team every semester and uh, just trying to figure out how this team works and uh, everyone's little problems and everyone's talents and stuff, and just reading people in general. So that's a really hard that's the job of the producer. Yep, exactly. And what are you guys working on? I'm working in game design. And uh, what have you, I guess, learned this year that you didn't know last year? Oh, this year, man, what I really learned is how difficult it is, uh, like he said, starting on a new project and getting the ball rolling at the start. You have to make sure that everything is set and you make sure you know what you're doing. Because the things we learned in the first year, absolutely, we learned so much. And uh, yeah, this year is uh, really hard so far, but we're uh, working on a really cool project and hopefully it'll turn out good. Are you guys all on the same team? Uh, actually, yes, we are on the same team. Uh, same right here is lead design. I'm lead gameplay design. Sean, Sean's on my team and uh, Matt's producer. Uh, we got, I think, about 50 guys on the team, so it's pretty intense. We have about 25 designers, uh, nine programmers, and about 15 artists. So it's, uh, it's a big deal. It's a big project, and you know, we're learning a lot about the problems and the pitfalls <laughs> that we're running into. Uh, All right, so let's talk about it. What are some of the pitfalls that you've run into? Oh, God, well, right now, for designers, we're waiting on uh, programmers to get us a uh, 2D proof of concept before we can move forward. So, you know, we're kind of stuck in the 2D prototyping phase when we want to be moving ahead. Uh, that's the biggest issue right now that we're running into, along with we have no idea what the phone can handle, we have no idea what our programmers can do with the phone. So, you know, it's it's just the whole thing is uh, we're a little bit blind, but, you know, we're confident we got a great design, uh, we got great artists, great programmers, and we're going to come out with an awesome product. All right, this is what I want to know from any of you who can answer it. Give me the most creative solution you've come up with a very complicated sort of team problem. Um, increasing map size when uh, things weren't fun. Uh, it's, it's, it, that seemed to be a, a big one with us. We were having a problem with a map and it just wasn't fun, it wasn't working out. We thought it was fun when we prototyped it and it just, it, we increased the map size, changed the layout of level look of it, looked up some you know new information about how the how the area would look in real life. I can't say too much about it, but uh, th that really helped, changing the, 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 the exact size and the level layout. Agree, any other story maybe? Um, no, that's probably like the biggest thing I've seen in design. Uh, we can only talk about design because we're just on, on the design team right now, but uh, uh, yeah, pretty much, like, it, like he said, the levels, like we just gotta keep looking at them, iterating on them, and just making them the best that we can.